Uh, I didn't like the first quarter. Uh, I thought they were more physical team and they were moving us around. Uh, so we didn't love our start. Second quarter was much better, much better defensive mindset. And the game got a little bit up and down in the in the third for both teams, but we were more competitive. But the start really hurt us. A um, lot to learn from this game. Offensively with the start, did you see at least the intent to have more ball movement, more player movement? Not as much as we probably would have liked. Um, their physicality bothered us. Um, but th these are the things we're going to go through to learn from. What were your first impressions of uh, Poole at playing the game? Uh, he was fine. You know, he was trying to get us organized, you know, trying to get some speed into the game. I thought he would, as the game settled in, he got his game going a little bit. BK, what did you like about the way you cleaned up the turnovers in the second half? Only six in that second half compared to the 13 in the first. Yeah, we tried to be a little bit more ball movement, shared a little bit. I think we were playing in crowds and getting a little sticky in that first half. Their physicality bothered us. I thought we showed some improvement in that in the second. That third quarter, you had the five of Bub, Keyshawn, Bagley, Davis, and PPJ. They made that 16-5 to five run. What was it about that group that you really liked about what they were doing? I was their defense, you know, defense to offense, you know, some shot blocking at the rim, and then, you know, we were attacking, getting some offensive rebounds, but it started with our defense. Uh, did you think that Alex saw our play? Yeah, you know, I thought he did good. It was, I think he was getting a little his feet wet underneath him that first quarter, but after that he played pretty well, um, showed his versatility, his ability to do multiple things on both ends of the floor. I thought he had a pretty good night. Uh, great, yeah, you could tell the crowd was great. They were enthusiastic, you know, great, really have enjoyed our time here the last few days, but, you know, crowd was into it. Uh, I mean, the Raptors have kind of made a point in the preseason of really emphasizing ball pressure, especially at the point of attack, and did you see any of that between Mitchell and Chevy? Yeah, I think their whole team did tonight. You could tell that's something they've been working on. You could feel their physicality. They were pressuring the ball pretty good, affected us tonight. Mm -hmm. With Saar, did you see more? Uh, no, I mean, this is, he's been doing this. He's been good for us the whole time, even it's going back to there. I just think his game's progressing. We're seeing him grow. We're learning about him on a game-to-game, -game, week week-to-week basis. So I uh, was happy with how he responded after a little bit of a tough start. Where did you see the progression of the growth? Shot, you know, offensive boards, challenging shots at the rim, his physicality, rolling, um, putting pressure on the rim. Yeah, I think we, to me, we, we actually didn't probably play with much pace. You know, we want to play with half court pace too, with a little bit more movement, harder cuts. I think their physicality caused us to have some unforced turnovers, but give them credit, they were physical tonight. Any other questions? Uh, pick and roll seem to have some success. What did you like about their Just, you know, Jordan's a threat when he comes off, and then, you know, Alex has the ability to play vertical at the rim, get down there really quick, so. Some we're learning about these guys, the combinations that work. Go ahead, Joe. Coach, talk about Keyshawn's play tonight. Obviously, a huge cheering section for him. Uh, what did that mean to him, and how did he look? Uh, I thought he looked as the game grew. Uh, game went, he grew and got better. Uh, I'm sure this was a thrill for him to come back and play from, you know, kind of like his hometown, you know, that's where his dad's from. But, you know, his shot making, his ability to see the game, those are the things I saw as the game progressed.